At what age do you officially become old? See where your opinion stands with The Bar Talk, live on The Brew. All right, Joel, so how old do you officially become old? Um, I think once you start hitting certain milestones in your life, like uh, Social Security age, um, the best general answer, I think, is 15 years older than you are. Because think about it, whatever age you are now, and then think of 15 years in the future, that seems old to you, doesn't it? It's an interesting answer I was not expecting. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. Um, I was gonna, I had a nice round number, and I was pretty much gonna say 75. And why I'm saying that is because now, like, the retirement age is becoming older and older. That's why they're riding in Paris right now, because it's the late 60s so you can retire. So by the time I get into my 70s, A, won't be able to retire, B, there'll be no Social Security to retire, and they keep wanting to push us to work longer and longer. So, you know, you can still pretty much work if you want at 75. I think you can handle your stuff then. A little bit a lot of, if, older than that, then you have a little bit of problems. But I think 75 is a nice round figure. Okay, that's a good answer, too. It's all, about, <laughs> it's all about working and making money, you know, for, for people or for yourself, too. Yeah, because you're going to have to feed yourself at some point, you know, nobody's going to do it for you. But um, our viewers have lots of interesting answers, so uh, how old are you do you officially become old? Let's find out. Uh, Art says the day after you were born. Nice. Barbara says 22. Real Treats Tweet says I felt old at thir about 35. I'd been working for 20 years at that point, a lot of that time working more than one job, so I was feeling old by then. Rafa Guitar says, I think it's 27 these days. Drew says, 45. Boalt DM123 says, 48. Starman chimes in with 60. Prince Nye says, 65. Mary Beth Jungwa says, whatever age you feel it. Ooh, that's a good question. So I guess, yeah, maybe it's a little bit different for everybody. They feel old at one point. Maybe you feel old at 30, but then other people feel old at 90. That's a good point. Yeah, and uh, I feel like you can definitely feel it in your bones after you hit maybe like 27-ish, you can start feeling it a little more. But uh, you can stay active and just kind of forget about that. Just have fun. Go out and do your normal thing. You'll definitely feel it in your bones too if you still have osteoporosis and not have calcium or something like that. When you walk yeah. and you're snapping your leg. Yeah, unless your bones are going to snap in half, but no. Yeah. I just went out to, uh, to Texas and did like 20 things in like three days. And that includes like climbing a mountain in uh, Austin and going up a tower and doing the river walk and all kinds of stuff. And I'm like, I'm, I was thinking about my age at the time. And I'm like, I'm, I don't feel old at all doing like 20 things like I used to do 10 years ago in my 20s when I had a lot of energy. You know, speaking of whether you're old at different ages or what, you know, and snapping bones easily, if you're Edwin Diaz for the Mets and you just jump up and down and you're in your 20s and you break a bone, I guess you're kind of makes you old then. <laughs> Age you up the least. Yeah, yeah, interesting. Uh, Charity says the day after you move, the day you move out of your parents' house. Ooh, interesting point. And finally, Noah's Noel says, Psh, haven't gotten there yet. Ooh, that is a pretty good learning point though. When you move out of your parents' house, and some people, like, like Noel says, she hasn't gotten there yet. But that's a good milestone moving out on your own. It is, but I don't know if that's necessarily what I was trying to say off the top of the show. I think we're too little different. Well, by the way. The joke, once you get a gray hair and you see it, I think once that happens to me, which I'm sure is coming up soon, once I see that, when I hear anybody in their 20s making that joke, like, oh, I'm 25, I'm so old, because I used to do that. I just want you to know, <laughs> I can't say it, so you don't have to bleep it, but. Nice. You, you know, speaking of early gray hair, like Anderson Cooper on CNN, he went gray in his 20s. I don't know if he was like trying to dye his hair to make himself look older, but I mean, he looked old in his 20s. Patrick Stewart, same thing as Captain Picard. He was like in his 40s and he was completely gray. So some people age at different things. I don't know. If I was going gray like that, I would definitely dye my hair like Bob Barker did for the longest time in the 80s. And all of a sudden, you become a silver fox. Yeah. He like, he believed. <laughs> He did believe. And you know what I believe? I believe you'll find lots more fun, quality entertainment when you click that like and subscribe button for all the fun here in the Big Jersey Joe 50 YouTube channel. Four big shows that never age and never get old, waiting for you each and every week. Well, some of the brew topics, I guess, do from way, way back in the early days. Some of them are kind of timely. But, uh, yeah, interesting. And um, I guess, yeah, it comes down to, like, you know, you when you feel old, you feel old. And it's for everybody, it's at a different time. Yeah. And I feel like we've gotten so old at doing the brew, there's no way we're going to not like remember that we're gonna we're gonna end up doing this show again at some point my tongue feels a little old right now it's just getting tongue-tied and my little brain's trying to reconnect here and we're live and trying to say what i want to say and if we weren't live i'd have retaking that whole thing again but hey we're uh <laughs>
it's it's off the cuff, so it's going out there for the deal. All right, we appreciate your comment, Jersey Joe, Ian, and you saying thanks for watching. And uh, stay young out there. We'll see you next time. I hope. More bad and funny bar reviews from Detroit. Streaming now on Kicking Back with Jersey Joe.